Hi, how's it going? This is Resident of Colwood for YouTube. Uh, back with some more Friday the 13th-ish news, I guess. Uh, Jason Universe Horror Inc. begins a new era of the Friday the 13th franchise. Here's the plan. I love how the picture of this, and I'll try to copy it, is Jason's hockey mask, the, Jason's name, and Universe is spelled U-N, the number one, V, the number three, Earth. <laughs> I am not shitting you. Um, <laughs> while we wait to see what happens with A24 and Peacock's planned Friday the 13th TV series, Crystal Lake, currently undergoing a showrunner change, Horror Inc. has announced Jason Universe via an exclusive report from IGN this afternoon, which is said to be the dawning of a new era for the for the original owners of the Friday the 13th franchise. What does that mean, you ask? IGN details in their surprising report today, new Friday the 13th activations will spawn a wide range of platforms from entertainment games, immersive experiences, meet, merchandise, and more to be announced as, as my page jumps as this page jumps around here. Uh, throughout 2024. For decades, Jason's shocked and thrilled audiences who kept coming back for more. We're excited to work with Victor Miller and Mark Tober Toborov on new projects we'll announce in the coming months, said Robert Barr Simon, president of Horror Inc. We're focused on honoring the legacy while elevating the fan experience and appealing to today's horror audiences as we develop new ways to watch, interact, and engage with the Jason universe. Uh, with the unique ability to remain at the forefront of pop culture for 44 years, Jason continues to top charts as one of the scariest villains, he's scary to look at, of all time. <laughs> A strong global awareness across multiple generations, thanks to billions of TikTok views, plus millions and millions of gamers and movie fans," uh, said Cheryl, or sorry, Sherry Khan, uh, global GM of Horror Inc. We can't wait to introduce new Jason Universe activ activations to these amazing fans. Victor Miller is the writer of the original Friday the 13th who won back the rights to the original horror classic several years back. The film's director, Sean Cunningham, has been battling Miller over a legal battle. Okay, that's that's nothing new. We knew that already. So really, it's not so much an update um, on the show in my opinion it's more an update on your gut we're going to get new jason merchandise probably another video game <coughs> and all sorts of cool stuff that's what that sounds like to me um i could be wrong um but so that's some friday the 13th news for you guys i know there's been a lot i'm going to try to copy this this picture they have because it is just funny as fuck uh <laughs> <laughs> when you see this, if you haven't already, um, have a good day. I can't stop laughing.